Hey guys, it's Joe from the Hey That's Pretty Cool. Today we're going to take a look at the Legacy Collection, Red Ranger. Here's the box. Franchise logo at the top. Season logo at the bottom. Build a Megazord. Nice portrait of Jason the Red Ranger with red lightning all over the package. Back. Shows the Builder figure and the other rangers that came in Wave 1. Wave 1 was Red Mighty Morphin, the one we're looking at today. Green Mighty Morphin. Red Ninja Storm. Blue Ninja Storm. And Yellow Ninja Storm. Now for its packaging. Let's take a look. Here he is. Jason the Red Ranger. Nice head sculpt. This morpher. Go over articulation real quick. This head's on that ball joint hinge. So it spins all the way around. He can look down and he can look up. Shoulders have that tight ratchet. He has a swivel at the bicut, cut, double jointed elbows, swivel at the glove cut, wrist up and down, and wrist swivel. Legs can go up, can go out, can't go back really, but that's because of the sculpt on the gluteus maximus has a swivel at the bicut, cut double jointed knees so he can kick in real nice swivel at the boot cut ankle rocker up and down and side to side and his is just like yellow so he can go way out beyond what would be normal for body articulation he has an ab crunch and crunch that far down that far up they did put the diamond underneath so you're not breaking up the design of the suit too much he has a waist swivel he can swivel all the way around for some reason and that's Jason the Red Ranger. His accessories are the same as all the other Core 5 Rangers. He has a holster and blade blaster in holster mode. Slide right in. Pop his arm out. There's the peg hole. Pegs in kind of loose, but this was the first legacy figure released. I just waited till I had the rest of the collection to do him. No weapons. But like I've said with all the other figures, if you had the Imagine X ones, you can use the Imagine X weapons. Look at that, that is a pretty nicely sculpted and painted power sword. It's not exactly to scale, but it's close enough. Doesn't look too bad. And the Build-A-Figure build piece included for the Build-A-Figure Megazord is the body. Nicely sculpted. Great paint apps, and it has head articulation. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Joe from Hey That's Pretty Cool. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos.